Good morning. I need to show you something very funny, exciting. Look at this cucumber <laughs> from my garden. <laughs> it is so massive. I, oh my gosh, got, so I got back from up north yesterday. I brought a bunch of produce from my garden back with me. So many cucumbers. So every day I'm just gonna have like a liter of cucumber juice and I'm, I'm very excited. Of course I'll eat a lot of them too, but like, like it's literally bigger than my arm. Anyways, that's exciting. So hello, welcome to another video. Thank you so much for being here with me. Um, I thought I would do a what I eat in a day plus like daily vlog. I feel like it's been a bit since I've done like a proper long format what I eat in a day. And that's what we are going to do. I also am going to eat fully raw vegan for the day. And I'm excited. I have so much good stuff from the garden. So a lot of what you're gonna see I um, grew or my mom grew or Blaze's mom grew. So it is end of August, September in two days. So we just, that's when like everything in um, Ontario seems to be ripe, be fully grown, ready to eat. So we have an abundance of food and that makes me really happy. Um, but anyways, I hope you are doing really well. Thanks again. Um, let me know if you have a garden. I want to know what you've planted, where you live, like what does really well. Because in Ontario, we can't really grow, like in Southern Ontario, we can grow um, some like stone fruits, peaches, apricots, apples, they do well, but like that's really it for like fruit, which is kind of sad, because you know, you know I love my fruit. But um, like cucumbers, squash, tomatoes, lettuce, they do pretty well in Southern Ontario, but for up north, um, the growing season is a lot shorter. So more just like cucumbers, lettuce, bean, like, yeah, green beans. Stuff like that. So let me know where you live and what you can grow. I just did like a shorter run, like 40 minutes. I think I'm gonna do a nice long run tomorrow. And I thought I'd pour myself a glass of coconut water. So important to rehydrate after a run, especially when it's hot. Sorry about the background noise. Neighbors are doing some construction, it seems like. Since my marathon back in May, I've just been like, running a decent amount doing like other workouts and just being really like intuitive with it since i'm not training for anything specific and it's been feeling really good right now it's just kind of like running doing some body weight workout stuff i feel like i need to build up my leg muscles a bit more to support my running um so yeah that's what i've been working on and it's been going well. It's nice not training for anything and just kind of going with the flow and enjoying it, but I'm thinking this fall I want to maybe do a race. We'll see. I don't know.
breakfast here. I have six bananas. I'm guessing I'll eat five, but you never know. Thought I'd bring them all anyways. And then I have nine dried figs that I've just been soaking in some water and a bunch of green leaf lettuce from the garden. So excited. Yeah, that is going to be my breakfast. I am also going to read for a bit. Um, I've been reading this book on my Kindle, A Court of Wings and Ruin. It's the third book in this trilogy. No, it's not a trilogy because there's five, whatever you call that. I think the first one's A Court of Thorns and Roses. This is by far my favorite book series. If you like, like, I guess fantasy fiction, I don't know, like adventure, magic, another world, oh, then you will love it. It's, I cannot recommend it more. I'm obsessed. I'm gonna cry when I finish the series. <sighs> Anyways, okay. I'm gonna eat and yeah. Washed a bunch of lettuce from the garden, did laundry, washed potatoes from the garden, put them outside to dry, and put them away. Watered the garden. Yeah, it's been a good afternoon. So, I think I might just go for a walk now, or no, have some lunch go for a walk, and then maybe this afternoon I'll just relax for a bit and read some more of my book and maybe do some writing. I've been really enjoying writing lately. What the- 